yep, it's here. A day 70 years in the making. You might have known it was coming because we've only mentioned it a couple thousand times over the last several months, but yes, it's here. Idaho's first television station went live for the very first time when Vern Moore stepped in front of a camera just after 2 p.m. on a Sunday in July, July 12, 1953. Well, from the early days of KIDO-TV to the current hot days of KTVB, whether you remember the Newsbeat days or you're just jumping in here with us in the 208, well, you can join in on the celebration down at the Grove Plaza at a Live After Five where you can now see Joe Paris, Andrew Bartline, and I also see Carolyn Hawley, some other familiar familial faces out there as well. Take it away, guys. Yes, good evening, Brian Holmes. I'm with KTVB legend Carolyn Hawley. Carolyn, I have a question for you in just a second, but first, Brian, I just want everyone to see the folks here at Alive After Five. They are getting ready for some live music coming up here. You got the kids and the families playing in the fountain, and Carolyn, uh, of course, it's Alive After Five. We absolutely love it all the time, but this, this week it's special. KTVB's 70th anniversary. It is amazing. You think of what businesses have lasted 70 years. I mean, it's incredible, and you asked me, what do you think the key he is to that. It's so hard to say, but to be honest with you, I think it's what our motto is, what our big poster is at the station, which is, you know, have the gold standard of journalism, gold standard of community service, gold standard of sales, do it right, commit to it, and we do it all for the viewers. We really, really do. But this is a unique place. You were very close to our viewerships, and, and we just want to invite you to come on down and have a party with us tonight. See, Carolyn's a legend, so she knows the roads, and she knows, you know, everything that's led to the 70th anniversary, and she and I were talking. It's about the people. The people in this community, it's different. It is, it is so different. I can't tell you enough. If you are new to the community, you probably know that, wow, the reporters and the anchors, they really feel the news that they deliver to you because we live it. You live it, right? Yeah, you you're to. here. You're you're paying taxes. You're at the grocery store. You're playing. Uh, it's not pickleball. What do you play? I don't know. Is it bowling? We play? We got it's oh, bowling. I don't have the bowling shirt on. I got the golf shirt on. We're part of your community, and and it's just very unique. I'm so glad you've come to spend your time with us, Joe. Well, it's a privilege to be part of Idaho's News Channel 7. And, you know, I was actually talking to one of your old friends this week, Rick Lance, and we were talking about the truth is Rick is the longest tenured KTVB employee ever. I mean, do you remember working with him? I mean, at the beginning of your career? I certainly do. And it's got to be early 80s, I'm thinking. And look at Rick. He's still there every night at 10 for you. So good for him. You know what? There's something about being part of Channel 7. You never let go of it. And that tells you how special it is. And that's probably another reason, part of the glue, yeah. that it, we've lasted for 70 years. And we're going to last for a lot longer.